Good morning. It is Saturday morning at 8.50. We were planning on sleeping in, but we got woken up early. This is Dexter's first time in the car with Darcy. He's doing so well. But we're going to take him to not the school that we usually go to because there's no fence there and we've never really let him off leash in the open. So we are going to a football field that has a fence around it. So it's his first outing. We'll see how he does. And today Cole, Scott's brother, is spending the night and we're going to a hockey game with some friends from church. So that's what's on the agenda. Say hello to the vlog family. You gotta look at him. Oh, hello. Say something nice. Good morning. field like you saw and then right when we got home we gave Dexter his first bath he did really well he just sat there and took it Darcy like tries to freak out and leave but he did pretty well and now we're going to Home Depot and the trash dump because we don't have like a trash service so we just take our bags of trash individually which is kind of annoying but it's fine I'm really stuffy today and sneezy I'm sure you heard that but I don't care what that groundhog says is spring spring has sprung and my body can't handle the pollen so I'm been snorting the flow nase and took an allergy pill too sorry about that but hopefully I caught it in time today because usually if my allergies are bad then it, they just get worse as the day goes on and then it's like kind of miserable for a day or two so hopefully I caught it in time because I'm excited to go to the hockey game and I don't want to be <laughs> the whole time, you know. We're also going to Ark Animal, which is like the vet that we go to, Animal Hospital, because Dexter is out of the eye gel, the ointment that we got from the shelter. So we're getting these drops that I think are the same thing. Just these are eye drops, which I believe will be easier. Don't you think? I uh, kind of thought the ointment was easier. But... I feel like with drops, like you just squeeze it and a, a few of them go in, but we'll see. So we're gonna go grab that and then just run some errands. And then Scott's gonna work outside because it's sunny and I'm gonna clean the house. I just got back from the library. Um, I was picking up my book. I think I told y'all that my goal is to read a book each month. So I went looking for this one and I was really happy that they had it. It's Into the Water by Paula Hawkins. She's the one who wrote Girl on the Train, which I read. But I really like books like that, like Gone Girl, The Girl on the Train, suspenseful and like kind of creepy books. So I think this one is about um, a single mother that turns up dead at the bottom of a river. So it's like a suspense and thriller. So I'm excited about that. I'll let you know how it goes. But Scott's working outside. We had Dexter in the front yard on a rope lead and I left him there while I went to the library. And luckily I wasn't gone too long because when I came back, he had chewed through most of the lead. So I got here just in time to put him back in the sunroom. So him and Darcy are sunbathing, watching Scott through the windows. And I'm about to clean this house up. I'm so really stuffy. My nose is turning red, but I'm committed to this vlog so i'm gonna clean this house oh i wanted to show you something though let me show you matthew my brother-in-law got me a birthday gift well probably laura probably picked it out too that's his fiance but okay let me show you what it is he gave it to me yesterday it's my birthday gift so it's from a few weeks ago but his fiance works at anthropology. Look at that bag. That's so pretty. I told Scott I'm going to save this in case we go to a baby shower with somebody who's like has an A name or is naming their baby an A name. But I love the burnt orange. Anyways, I love this packaging. But let me show you what it is. Look at this cute coffee mug. It's like navy and gold. I love it. 
and our the kitchen's back there but the kitchen and the dining room are basically this navy it's the paint is software by i think sherman williams or something it's the color software but this is gonna look so good in my kitchen it's so cute and a matching coaster look at how cute that is is it navy or is it black i thought it was navy it might be black either way it's gonna look good in my kitchen but look at how cute that is uh, i love it i think it's black now that i look at it in the sunlight it doesn't matter it's gonna look good in my kitchen look at how cute. I just got done hanging out with one of my best friends, Courtney. She came by to meet Dexter for the first time. So she lives in Charleston, so I don't get to see her that often. But she came by, and we talked for about two or three hours and just caught up on all kind of stuff. And we're hanging out. So now Scott's in the shower. He just finished doing a bunch of yard work. And we're about to go pick up his little brother, Cole, to go to dinner and then go to the hockey game with some people from church but I just finished editing a video and I'm about to I'm in the process of uploading it which I told y'all takes forever and I'm eating leftover pasta because I'm starving and I'm not me when I'm hungry I'm just kidding I get hangry and annoyed when I'm hungry so I thought for everybody's sake I would have appetizer of pasta but like I said, we're about to go pick up Cole and have a fun evening. We just finished eating. We went to Moe's and got some burritos. We have Cole in the back seat. Hey. There he is. Then we went, I ran into a Target right beside Moe's and got a venti vanilla iced coffee with cream but no classic syrup. Courtney used to work at Starbucks and from my understanding with this you get the vanilla syrup which is literally like vanilla with liquid sugar and then they add classic syrup which is just liquid sugar and then they add cream so it's a ton of sugar so I got no classic and it's more coffee -y, obviously not as sweet but it's pretty good and I do light ice because I think it's a ripoff for them to fill this whole thing with ice and then pour it so this whole big thing was 340 and me and scott can split it it's like we're both getting a grande or something but i needed a pick me up because as you can tell i'm still snotting and my nose is even redder and it makes my head hurt it makes me tired to be like breathing hard all day so this game starts at seven and i don't want to fall asleep during it or get a headache or anything so I'm about to chug this coffee and then I'll be wired. Scott, what are you most excited about for this game? Uh, I don't know. I just like sporting events. I don't really know that much about hockey. But... You've been to one game. Yeah. Cole, how many games have you been to? Um, one. One? And that was in a second grade field trip. That was second grade field trip. What are you most excited about? Um, just the action. The action. Who thinks that there's going to be a fist fight? You think there will be? Yeah. We're in like the third <clears throat> row, so we're pretty close. I don't want any kind of bodily fluids on me. There's a big, like... There's a screen. Yeah. I feel like you, I could still get hit in the face with a puck. Um, probably not, but keep dreaming. I don't want to be hit in the face with a puck. Okay. Okay. We'll see you when we get there. It is Monday now. The clips that you last saw were Saturday, um, Saturday night when we went to the hockey game, which was really fun. But I didn't film anything on Sunday, and so I thought I'll just film a little bit more today since Saturday's vlog footage was pretty short. Um, Sunday, we just went to church, um, went to lunch. Cole's parents came and got him, and then we went to the grocery store and went to small group, which is a new thing that we're doing. But so far, we like it. And if you're not familiar with it, it's basically like, for us, it's like eight-ish, maybe eight to ten people. 
who get together sometime during the week and it's like a Bible study, but also like a friend group that you hang out with and kind of do life with. So anyways, so far we're liking that. And we did that and then we came home and cuddled with the dogs and then we went to sleep. So today I woke up and then I went to the gym. I did something new at the gym. So I told y'all that I was doing increments to get my speed up, but today I tried to get my distance a little longer. And somebody in our small group actually, he said he used to do cross country and would like set a timer for 30 minutes and run as far as he could. So I tried that. I only did, I set my mental timer at 20 minutes. So I watched two YouTube videos that were 20 minutes. And so I ran, I actually ended up running 23 minutes straight, but which was over a mile and a half because I was going pretty slow, but I was really proud of myself for going 20 minutes, 23 minutes without stopping. So that's good. So I told y'all my goal is to do the 5k at the end of March, at the end of April. And so even if it takes me 40 minutes, like at least today I did at least half of a 5k. So I was excited about that. And then I came home, took a shower, and now I have, I just made this. It's like my brunch, even though I'm, I haven't eaten it yet, but I think I'm still gonna be hungry. So later I'll probably make a wrap, but it's like an English muffin with turkey and egg and shredded cheese. So I'm gonna eat that. I already had a banana, drinking my water. But tonight me and Scott are babysitting our nephew, which I'm very excited about. And today, I was gonna go get an eye exam at Costco. I've never been there to do that. But I called and their doctor's not in until Tuesday. And so I can't do that because I work every other day this week. So I can't do that. So I think I'm just gonna read my book, the, the Into the Water. I read like one or two chapters yesterday, but we were kind of busy. So I didn't get to read too much. So I'm with little Sam Sam. He doesn't feel very good and he is not happy that I am not his mom. You thought you were gonna see your mama, but instead you saw me. But we're about to heat up some SkettiOs and then he'll probably be happy. We're gonna have SkettiOs, have playtime, have bath time, and then have bedtime. Yeah. You don't feel good, but you look good, buddy. Let's get some SkettiOs for the baby. It's about nine o'clock now and we're back home from babysitting. We had a good time, Sam was good. And now we're just gonna settle down and get ready for bed. But thank you for watching the past few days. I uh, hope you enjoyed watching and I hope you subscribe. Hit that subscribe button, smash that bell, and hit the notifications so you get notified when she posts a new video. Do that.